Hey guys, what's up? Mike McDonald here, just coming out of Minneapolis, Minnesota. In today's video, I just wanted to go over some leadership tips and mostly talk about running your own race. So I don't know if you ever feel like you're you know, comparing yourself to someone more successful or somebody else that has more results and you know, maybe beat yourself up or you get frustrated you know, thinking, you know, why am I not at their level or why am I not doing this or why am I not doing as well as this person? And the biggest thing you got to keep in mind is you don't want to compare your beginning to somebody else's middle. So maybe those people have a lot more experience under their belt or, you know, maybe they've been working in your industry a lot longer or they, you know, maybe they came into your business or your industry uh, with more experience or more personal development. So it's like some people start, let's say the end goal is to get to the, you know, get that touchdown, get to, you know, cross that goal line. Cool. Well, some people, they're they're coming into your business or coming into your industry and they're starting on the 50 yard line already. You know, they have personal development. They've worked on themselves already. Maybe they have business experience or whatever the case is. They're starting on that 50 yard line. Then there's other people, maybe they're starting on the 20 or maybe like my case, when I started in the industry, I was in the parking lot, you know, so I had a long way to go. Uh, a lot of personal development, a lot of training, a lot of stuff I needed to get better at to improve my skills. But at the same time, anybody can do that. You know, it's not like a professional sport where, yeah, you need like specific, you know, muscle mass or specific body type or, you know, natural abilities that, you know, some people, it doesn't matter. You know, if you're 5'4", and you're trying to be a professional basketball player, it's probably not going to be the most likely situation. You know, it doesn't matter how much you train or how much you work on your stuff. It's going to be a lot harder to be, you know, a professional athlete in that industry where, you know, if you're in business or you're in sales or, you know, real estate, insurance, whatever, you can continually work on your skills and get better. Like, there's nothing that can stop you or hold you back except for you. So, again, don't focus on, you know, where you're not. Just focus on, you know, where you're at and how you can improve you know, don't judge your future uh, based on your past. You're, you know, don't let your past talk to your present about your future and where you're going. So don't let things that have, you've, you know, held you back before, or things that you're lacking, you know, determine where you're going to go in your future. So you can constantly get better, constantly improve your own skills, you know, but just run your own race. Stop comparing yourself to other people that are at different points in their business. Um, just focus on you, you know, get better yourself. If you want to recruit and attract and work with tens, you know, top people, sharp clients, you know, work on yourself, make yourself that 10, make yourself better, always continually working on yourself uh, to get to that new level. And again, your business is going to catch up to you. you know, I'm a firm believer that, you know, your business only grows as much as you do. So if you can work on yourself and improve and get better, uh, you can really take your business to that next level. But at the same time, it's a process, you know, run your own race, look at it like a marathon where, you know, people don't go necessarily go into a marathon looking to win. They just go into it looking to finish. So again, finish your race, finish your marathon, get to the top. But again, work on yourself, make yourself better and stop comparing yourself to other people. And it's going to save you a lot of frustration and headaches down the road. I guarantee it, which is cool. So again, if you found value in this video, please comment, share. And uh, again, if you are looking for more leadership training, uh, check out coachmikemcdonald.com. You can actually click on the link in the description below. And I have all kinds of different leadership training, sales training, uh, lots of free videos you can check out on that site as well. So head on over to coachmikemcdonald.com. But appreciate everybody's time. We'll look forward to talking to you again soon.